Hey everyone and welcome back to another Bisect Hosting server tutorial. In today's tutorial, we're going to go over how to reset a world on a Bedrock server. There are two different ways you can do this. You can do it by creating a new world, or you can also delete the current world and it will automatically create a new world. We'll go over how to do both of these. But before we do, make sure to back up any saves locally so you don't lose any files. We will first go over how to reset the world by creating a new world. First, you're going to log into the Bicycle Toasting Games panel and choose your Bedrock server. You are then going to stop the server by choosing the red Stop button. We're then going to go to the File Manager tab, and we want to open the Server.Properties file. Where the line says Level-Name Equals, we can change after the equal sign a new name. This will automatically create a new world once we rerun our server. So we're just going to call this New Bedrock. Once we have that done, we can choose the blue Save Content button, then go back to the console, start our server, and we'll have a new world saved on our server. We will now go over how to reset a world by deleting the current world. First, we will log into the Bicycle Toasting Games panel and choose our Bedrock server. Next, we will choose the red Stop button to stop our server. We're then going to go to the File Manager tab, and we're going to open the Worlds folder. Here, you will have all the worlds on your Bedrock server, and we are going to check the checkbox next to the current world that is being run right now. Then we're then going to choose the red Delete button to delete this world. And then we can confirm it by saying, yes, delete files. Once that is finished deleting, we can go back to the console, start our server, and a new world will be created in its place. If you have any questions, check out our knowledge base, bisecthosting.com kb or you can submit a support ticket on our website. If this guide was helpful, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe for more content like this, comment down below which guide you would like to see next, and we'll see you around.